where have you been? Oh, <laughs> uh, I went over to Michael and then I had a long run. He disappeared for like three hours. Was maximum an hour. Was it that long? Well, yeah. I'm sorry. What do you want me to say? A lot of people depend on me. I'm a very important person. Stop, please. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's see. <gasps> 22 degrees! I don't know what I should wear. I really wanted to wear these pants, but they are massive on me. I'm just gonna roll them up and maybe that will do it. I don't even think I said good morning today, but good morning. We are ready to go. I went with the pants because I think that with the shoes it kind of goes well anyway. Look at Gaba. He's crazy. He's gone too far. Oh my god. <laughs> so we're going to eat a lemonade which someone in the comments recommended it and we saw it last night so we're gonna go there hopefully there is space looking forward to it because I'm really hungry let's go eh. <laughs> well thank you <laughs> please wait welcome whoa Changed the tone, didn't she? <laughs> Welcome to your night. <laughs> Back at the downtown California. Oh, there's. The oh, there's the beach. Yeah, the <laughs> yeah, there's the ocean. Said it at the same time. I throw myself right off the bridge just to catch your eye. Don't let my lack of confidence make you walk on by. Is it out of line to say you're fine? What do you say? Hey. It's none of my concern if you don't want to say. Allow me to show you what I found. Here are the two things I got. The first is a pair of brown boots. And I like that they wrap around like this. I've never seen it before. And I also like the fact that they match this little bag. I found the backpack at Nasty Girl and it was vintage. And I love it, it's so tiny and cute. Yeah, come in. I'm watching your vlog. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Come in. Nice pause there. On the, On the penis? Hey, no, Matsya, I can't believe you put that in. <laughs> oh, <laughs> let me join. Oh. <laughs> I need a hair curler. Because the one I have is bad. Getting onto my pajama. Oh no, I made a hole. Look at that, what? It's about 6.30, I'm kind of having a headache right now, so I chilled out for a bit, but I have so much to do tonight that I just really can't relax too much. Um... Okay, so I'm gonna go with penne and some avocado sauce. What up? I'm gonna put that in the mix, and then on top, I'm gonna add these just to get some crunchiness. How do you call these? We call them pinoli, but I don't know how you call them here. I mean, in English. And voila, the pasta is ready. So a lot of you are confused. I'm vegetarian, I'm not vegan, but it might seem like I'm vegan because for health reasons, I should avoid anything with lactose and eggs. So I try to keep a vegan diet, but I won't stop myself from getting, I don't know, a donut that was made with egg and milk or something like that. So I'm vegetarian, I'm not vegan really. You know what? It's actually pretty creepy to eat, giving my back to these windows. Can you imagine if I'm editing this footage and I realized that someone was standing behind me? I'm gonna move away. I'm going to Okay, let's get working, shall we? This course is really, really cool because I'm learning so much. One of the first things that I had to do was a floor plan and depending on what the client was asking, I had to redo it. After that, I had to do the electricity system. I got to select three different color palettes to present to the client, which in this case doesn't exist, but it's just for the teacher to judge if you're understanding or not and like the color theory and then you pick one of those three and you move on to the finishes which means 
all the little details so now the next thing I have to do is about the textile so for now let me show you what I got so over here is the floor plan they wanted an open plan space with the kitchen and living room together and then they wanted a studio and a bath and the laundry then we got into the options of the colors so there is a monochromatic one which I pictured it as if their house is like a beach house the second option is the achromatic one which is the more modern one and so if they have a city house this could be great and I picture it with marble and the final one is the split complementary I selected you, you get a ton of options but these are the colors I went for and then there is the mood board so you get to see it so out of those three color choices I went for the second one which was the modern one and so here are the floors, you get the parquet and then the carpet and then for the bathroom I gave it some stone. This is the finish schedule for the kitchen, the bathroom and the laundry so you have to select all the little fittings and stuff. And then you get to do one for the lighting as well. You know, it, it's really fun, it takes a lot of time to select everything but I love it. And so as I said, right now I'm doing textiles and fabrics. It usually takes me around five hours if I'm really focused. So I think I'm gonna go in isolation right now and I'll see you when I'm either halfway done or hopefully done. I don't know if I can manage to do everything because I'm really tired, but we'll give it a go. Officially just got halfway done. I had to do the upholstery first, now I have to do the curtains and the same thing. All these little details take ages. Right now it's 9.34, so two hours. Here's the curtain weight. I don't know if you can tell. There it is. It's all done now. I really hope this video wasn't boring. It's just that I have to study. Sometimes things like this are gonna get in the way of the fun vlogs. But I hope you enjoyed being with me anyway. And I'm gonna go now. See you tomorrow. Bye! Thanks for watching!